I started playing football at a very young age. Uh, I can't can't remember. Uh, I've always had a football in my hand since uh, since I can remember. So it's always been a part of my life and part of my family's life. We've always been a huge fan of the game. So it's always it's always been a huge part. What I love most about football is just the camaraderie about. Uh, having the brothership of the guys, just always having that the brother to lean on, the coaches that always they're just always there for you. If you're feeling down, you can always go to your teammates, and just just the excitement of the game, the crowds, just the Friday night lights, everything about it just gets me so excited. One of my goals is to get to the playoffs again. Uh, last year was our first year, J. Sarah, in history that we've ever gotten to the playoffs. So that was a cool, cool moment. We need to get there again this year. And so hopefully we can get there, get uh, farther than last year, do better than last year. So that's one of my main goals. And just be successful, play as uh, well as I can play, and bring up the others around me, play, so have them play as well as they can play. Representing J. Sarah as a uh, student athlete is awesome because it's your high school and uh, you have all your friends that go there. Everyone's rooting for you. You have uh, much more uh, people just around and I think it's super cool that uh, people are always there watching. The games are always crowded, packed and just being around your brothers all the time. It's really cool. Probably the best moment of my high school career in football has been this last year beating Santa Margarita. It was our very first it was my very first Trinity League football game, so I was very excited for that. And we ended up beating them in a very close game and the locker room afterwards was just amazing. The energy, the coaches, all the players. It was just a great, great feeling and I'll I'll never forget I'll never forget it. One of my role models is definitely my dad because he just has a major role in my life. He's always there for me when I'm down. He's there for me when I need a friend. He's always been that football role model also, telling me what to do, uh, critiquing me, but he's also there to build me up when I'm down. And also just always being there for me when I need that friend, need that, that extra motivation just to keep going. And he's, he's, always, he's just a huge part of my life and I love him. In college, I, my goal is to play college football but I haven't put much thought into where I want to go or what I want to do. All I know is that uh, psychology uh, interests me, so I'm going to look into that and see where that takes me. And, but yeah, as of right now, I want to play college football. Some life lessons that football has taught me has been to never give up and always just keep going no matter how hard it is. Life is going to be a struggle. You just got to keep fighting, keep, keep trying, keep never give up, because you, uh, you must never, you can't give up to be successful, or else you're always going to fail. But it's how you, it's how you come back from that failure is how, is how you'll succeed. Before coming to J. Sarah, I, I was a Catholic, but we, we didn't go to church much. We went on the days of obligation. But uh, going into J. Sarah and having that, uh, the holy side, the uh, spiritual side, has really helped me get through some times when I was really struggling, struggling going to, going to practice. I just look up to God and help me get through it, ask Him to help me get through it, and just really be there for me. And it's really helped out a lot. Mm -hmm.